Hey there guys, I have definitely made this deck worse. My latest change to this deck is a horrible and terrible idea, which I will regret for all eternity. Uh, this hand is dope McNasty Balls though. This is an amazing hand. I'm excited, you're excited, let's play some magic. Let's get in here. Spell Slinger's still around, I can't be a Spell Slinger again though, you gotta keep it fresh and funk at free so i can't be a spell slinger again it's just too much hey gain some life with your foil bs hey gain some more life you're doing it you're doing it he doesn't gain life right now but he'll gain five life eventually uh i'm gonna get a land in my hand i think i think that's the play all day i'll draw a card later right now I'll get one more land no, I won't. I'll put a bunch of shit in the yard. Awesome. This is working out great. I do have this, though, which is fine. Uh, those demons, however... Well, that doesn't look good. I never noticed the dudes that he had there. He's not uh, helpful. Hey, this guy's terrible. Uh... I mean, I kind of just want to quit out. Wow. I don't even know what to say to that. It's disconcerting, that's for sure. I'll tell you that much. What I get that time? Pelica Worm! I'm going to show you how to gain life, bud. I'll show you some life gain. If you want to see some life gain, we'll get some life gain going for you. I'll tell you that right now. What you got? Hey, great deck, man. You're doing it. You're, you're getting it done. So there's no way to discard stuff, though, which I was bummed out about. You can't... There's absolutely no way to abuse card, uh, card discard. I mean, unless you, I guess you could like mind rot yourself, right? But there's no creature that does it, I mean. Uh, hopefully I get another land here so that I can rescue from the underworld, get that Pelica Worm out and just stomp McNasty Balls all over this dude. Because Pelica Worm's what I get here, even though I would love to have this uh, Indulgent Tormentor, he would just get rid of life. Well, maybe not, he apparently loves life, which is good. You should have a zeal, a zest for life. Uh, you should go for a real enjoyment out of it. Is that even colorless, or is that just one? No, it's just it's just one. Holy balls, dude. What are you doing with your life? No attacks. Okay, this is old school. It's like when you're, you're first learning. Um, that sucks. That is a shitty, shitty draw. Freaking Pelica Worm in my hand. That's what's upsetting is that you'll get a lot of hands with a bunch of dudes in your hand. And that's tough. Like, you can't have those big fat dudes in your hand. I, I don't want to add discard in here just to use it on myself. But, man, it's getting ugly. It is getting ugly. I'll tell you that. This guy's at 30. He's got a bunch of life. I'll also tell you that. Uh, two dudes are coming. And it's these two. For four. Try and get him back down to, like, semi-manageable. What's he doing now? The hell are you doing? What's that even do? If you guys could see the look on my face, I mean, honestly, I, I'm distressed at this moment in time. I'm upset. <laughs> I'm saddened. Uh, I'm a whole lot of other stuff. I don't even know right now.
That's as a cost of playing it, right? Yeah, so you can't actually do anything to that. Well, that's pretty good, then. I mean, that's that's a much different ball game than what I originally was thinking about that card. That's a good little card, Risky from the Underworld. Four, five, six. That's seven, so I'll play this so I can play my dude now. Um... I mean, I don't know what to get here, to be honest with you. Doubling season doesn't really matter. I almost kind of just want to get the Viscopa Guild Mage and do it that way. Oh, it's good. So that's what I did to this deck. I added in a Graveborn Muse, or two Graveborn Muses. Uh, for card draw, because I have so much life gain already, I thought that'd be okay, because at the very least, she's going to draw one card and be able to chump and stuff like that, but I do have zombies in here. Uh, Gutter Snipe in a deck that has one spell so far. It's interesting. Because I could have got Seance and started putting those guys out, but those guys are not super useful. Unless you've got other stuff cooking. I do have this as well, so I can... Do a bunch of stuff, actually. Let's do this first off. Because I could just cycle out the 6-6 six, six and get the... There is the third Pelica Worm is in the yard, I believe. Or at the very least, get one of the Fivers. Okay. Okay. Alright. Um, I'll kill that thing... That's six. I can't kill anything else, right? Wait a minute. It doesn't really matter there. I ran out of juice. Coordinated Assault does what? Uh, Rescue from the Underworld. Yes. Okay. I get to draw a card. Pelican Worm will come back into play, which will be nice. I need to play this Graveborn Muse. I don't know. I just, uh, I don't know. I can't discard, so I felt like card draw would be the next best thing. I see these zombie guys all the time. The problem that I have with this deck is that I hardly ever see the, uh, the Satter guy he like does not want to show up on time for work and that's a big issue for me most of the time that's a big deal so it sucked i used that that way i mean i did get the card draw and everything which is okay what the hell does that even do awesome your stuff's all got plus one plus one good work why is this not just a goblin deck it's obviously what you're trying to do uh, I think it's time for some block skis. Block skis deli is where we're going here. What can this guy do here? Hold on. God damn it. God damn it, game. Haste. Okay, so that doesn't even matter. Uh, I'll kill this thing. I'll block down five. I'll block down six. I can take four, though, because I'm going to gain seven back, so that's fine. So now Graveborn Muse doesn't do anything. I don't know, you guys. I don't know. Who am I to make these kinds of decisions? Bunch of shit's about to happen here, though. Yup. The boys are back in town. Oh, boy. Interesting. Uh, I could just straight up Pelica Worm. That's eight. So I could Grizzle Bees too. Let's well, Grizzle Bees then. Let's do it. He's the most ridiculous. 
I love that friggin' guy. This friggin' guy. I'll tell you what. Lucky me. Lucky me indeed. Um. Well, Grizzles will block down. And I should stop this, uh, this eight, right? Probably. Probably a good call. Because he's the red guy. Something bad could happen. Ooh, double strike. It's not enough. It will kill him, but it's not enough to stop the 6-6 six -six from dying as well. That's what I'm trying to say. Where I'm from, that would have been a bigger deal. I got 11 in the air. I'm going to choose you. So you either sack a guy, give me another card. What is your choice? Pick your poison, friends. Gave me the card. Interesting. Uh, can I, I can just beat him now, though, right? With the Viscopa. I put this white mana down. I Plague Viscopa Guild Mage. Well, actually, I don't have to do that at all because he can't block the ground assault either. So I just attack right here and win. Never mind. Here I am trying to think of things. Lucky me. I got through that one by a skin of my balls right there. Was... It's fucking close. Oh, my God. Whew. Sweating over here. That was scary. You guys, I'm upset with you. That's right, with you. Not you, you. Because nobody told me about Freedom Planet. I didn't even know this game existed. I'm going to be checking that out for sure. It looks amazing. I might do something with that on Technovolver. I've been playing more Shovel Knight, trying to get through that. See, like this is my thing. Like, what the, oh, these opening hands. Oh, yeah, that's way better. Okay, these opening hands, they're, it's drawing way better since I added her in. Like, I don't know. I still don't like having this Pelica Worm in my hand, though. It's very, very sad. It makes me frown. Because I don't think... You guys will have to tell me if I'm missing something, but I don't think there's a creature out there. I'm going to have to look and see if there are some spells that are, like, good discard card variations where I could do something with that. But I don't want to spend mana to have to do... You know, I'd rather just have it be an ability... What's that one girl do? Oh no, she just powers up and then does it. She just keeps tapping. It's the one drop. It taps and it gets a uh, token on it and it's not discard or anything. See, like, I'm just straight bonered right now. I have two friggin' Pelica Worms in hand. Two out of the three. Rescue from the Underworld is just chilling. At least I get to block this guy. Christ. Isn't that the thing that breaks enchantments or whatever? think so oh no it's land guy did he play that other land last time why can't i love how it forces me to stare at that for a while longer it's like you're not done looking at this yet i'll let you know when you're done looking at this like i'm pretty sure i'm done a block just want you to know okay we're all on the same page then see i don't feel like graveborn muses is, is bad here She's going to draw me a card. I don't know. I don't... I don't see how this is a bad play. Like, she's going to get down there and she's going to draw me one extra card. I got two cards every turn. She's a 3-3, three, three, which means she can do some blocking. Because I don't really care if she dies. Because eventually I'm going to take a bunch of... Like, look at this matchup right here. I got a bunch of 1-1s one across the table for me. I'm assuming that this guy's like Selesnia Tokens. I've got my black sources out. Like, I'm ready to rock and roll here. What kind of blocks am I looking at if I bash in with this 2 2, do you think? None, probably, right? Yep, the land can't attack game. I would like to use the 2 2. I mean, maybe he kills this with a double block. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's, that's kind of cool. That's fine.
I don't really have a problem with the way things are going right now. I've got a 3-3 out. He's got a 1-1. One, one. I would not block with her right now, though, because he's the green guy. He's obviously got tricks that he can do. He can perform trickery. That effing thing. I also don't like the fact that this deck doesn't have removal, but that's just me. So I'm going to take, I'm going to get pinged here. That guy's got reach. I'm at 19, but I just, I don't know, man. I really like that. I really do. Because sometimes you even have more dudes out. That's the thing. So I could have just played Viscopa and used its ability, but I need, I want the card draw. I'm all about drawing cards. And nothing he has has trample. So I'm going to keep drawing cards till I'm blue in the face. My attack for six, I will chump lock with a 1-1. One, one. Won't even use my wall. Your turn. Because I got her in here. I've got the uh, one demon guy. Because I never see that sadder, like I was saying. I mean, I never see that thing. I'll block this, man. I mean, you could do 10 damage to me right here. Just cold. I don't want that to happen. For one mana, you could absolutely just ruin my day. I love that Convoke card, uh, the tap and then uh, plus two, plus two. That's hot. I like that. Uh, do I have enough black sources for the stuff that I want to play? Yes, I do. So this is also helping me getting up to that uh, discard that we were talking about. Well, I'm going to bash for four. No, I'll just bash for three. I want to chump block that six, six again. Forgot about that. I'll be the first to admit. I forgot about that. Whoops! Have a 5-3. Oh, I don't like that at all. He got me there. You got me bad. Got me dead to rights. Oh, read me the riot act. I don't have enough green sources to play this freaking Pelico Worms, though. I'll tell you that. What do I get with the Rune Scar? Like... I don't even know. Gotta block those down, man. Gotta block those down. Because I can't afford to get hit. Be honest with you. Friggin' Pelica Worm. Oh my god. Is a worm of Pelica. I wonder if that's going to lose it for me. So that's entirely possible. I need one more green source to be able to play this Pelica worm. Doubling season does not exactly help right now. like this I don't like this one bit that's why I'm trying to gain the life here because I don't like this at all I need a green source so I can pelica worm oh buddy rune scar demon gets me seance this is not looking good for me pump I'm in trouble knew that was happening I knew I mean I knew he had yeah primal bellow I called that from second one said he had primal bellow but now it doesn't matter because it was a trample guy anyway oh I need to gain seven life really bad how many primal bellows are in there oh god it could be four of them let me draw a card dude Oh, this is ugly as hell. 
This is the ugliest. If he's got another primal bellow. If he's got another primal bellow, I'm in deep shit. Let's put it that way. I was thinking about doing the whole life gain thing again, but... right now maybe I shouldn't have played the doubling season because maybe what I need to be thinking about is the planner chaos with the rune scarred demon because I can do that too and then I could have gained the life here One card in hand, it very well could be the end of me right here. Yeah, he has it. God damn it. He doesn't have it? Wouldn't that have done enough damage? Would have done enough damage if he had had it. I should have gained the life instead of playing the doubling season because then I would have been able to play Rinsguard Demon this turn and get the... and get what I needed to get. Because I'd be at 14 life right now. God damn it, I just didn't have the foresight. I was too short-sighted and it is going to cost me this game. I mean, if I could, I so what I did lose because I lost, I got rid of my Graveborn Muse like an idiot. Because that card draw would have done it for me. I really do think that that card draw would have got me there. Six six staying home. Interesting. I have to block, because if he has the Primal Bellows, I lose. Primal Bellow, I lose. I have to draw removal. I have to draw Planner Chaos. Or Planner Cleansing, or whatever it is. Did you just kill me? What the hell is that? Well, that's not good. That's not good at all. That is not a favorable turn of events. Jesus Christ. Oh my God, what am I doing? I kind of wish I had fog in here right now. Like I'm just desperately thinking about life. Look who's got Seance over there. Oh, that's a good interaction. That's nice. I take three. I go ten. I really, really need plan. If I don't get planner cleansing, I lose here, right? Oh no! I just about lose anyway. Can't do that now. I 
I don't know what I'm gonna draw yet. It doesn't even matter. Like, I, I can't do that. That's insane. Shit. God damn it. Is there anything for two mana that I can even, like, hope to accomplish? Just another blocker. Let's try and get there, I guess. I mean, I don't even know. He's got other Pelica Worms in the yard, though. They're gonna kill my 6-6, six -six, and then he's gonna bash in. Oh, he doesn't have another Pelica Worm. He doesn't even have anything to get with Seance, does he? He's got something. Oh, yeah, a little card draw, dude. Ooh, why wouldn't he be taking that to my face now? You know, like, wouldn't that would be my play? So did I lose this again because I tutored for the wrong card? No, I still lost. I would have lost either way. If he just aimed all these at my face, I'd be dead right now. If I had got the planner cleansing, I would be okay right now. Oh my god, this is just stupid at this point. Like, I think I'm somehow gonna do this, aren't I? Because his goes off, but then mine goes off. Mine resolves first. I've got doubling season. I just gained 14 life. Oh my god, I made so many mistakes. I should have lost this so long ago. You should have gone to my face, brother. But I couldn't have got the planner cleansing because I expected him to go to my face, right? Because he had two dudes out and the 6-6. Six -six. I expected him to make another one, three damage to me. No, because I could have chumped down. The damage to the 6-6 six -six is what I don't understand. Killing the 0-4. The 0-4 wouldn't have been out, though. I don't know. Like, I don't know if that was the right play or not. I guess not, but... Okay, I'm going to have to watch this back. If I had got, say, so I've got the 6-6 six, six out. Any way you slice it, he should have taken the damage to my face. I mean, no matter what. I need a Viscopa Guild Mage. I'm thinking of what to get from with Rescue now. And I need a Viscopa Guild Mage. 
And this is the guy, yeah. Oh my god. <sighs> He's going to get me something, but what do I even get here? I mean, it's got to be Pelico Worm or... Okay, and now... I've got a ton of mana. Do I not have enough black sources for him and I got him like an idiot? I gotta wait on that. I can't really attack right now, right? Jesus. What's he have left in his yard? I could have done it with the Pelica Worm right there. I could have given it... No, cause, yeah, because I do have two black sources. So I could have attacked with the one Pelica Worm and given it... Creature to... Exile. I mean, this turn, though, I can just attack him in the air and kill him, right? I can also just use the Rune Scar Demon again. Or not, because that's 11, and then if I give him... Yeah, because I should be able to do the whenever you gain life thing. I really wanted that Grizzle Brand to be down on the table, but obviously I am too stupid to know how many Black Sources I have. Don't I have enough Black Sources? Why didn't... Why couldn't I play Grizzle Brand? Because I have enough black sources. I'm looking at three black sources right now. Oh, he's four. God damn it. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm so frazzled after this. Holy shit. I don't even know anymore. Oh my god. There's so much bullshit going on right now. Whoa. No. I guess. I don't even know, like, I don't even want to commentate on this anymore because it's, like, such a fucking mess. This is such a clusterfuck at this point. Oh my god.
Yeah, that is all my black sources. So then I can't use... So I've got three of each on this Copa Guild Mage. This should be it. So that's six damage in the air. God, I think that should do it, shouldn't it? No? Not quite? Oh, there's those triggers. Those triggers. A little delayed reaction timer on those. Okay, so I'm too off. I'm at 35 and he's at 8, though. I think we're probably okay at this point. Let's get some walls out here, because I don't even know anymore. I'm so, I'm like, holy shit. I'm so bad at this game. I'm getting better. I'm learning, though. I mean, I should have got the planner cleansing, because then I would have had... So I would have had Seance out and Doubling Season out, and he would have had jack shit. I would have just dominated him if that had been what I had done. I'm at 35 life, though. I guess he's getting around blockers now. He can pump something by six, I guess. All I have to do is trigger Vizcopa and play Pelica Worm, and I win. He's going to gain 8 life, so never mind. I'm going to kill one of my Vizcopa guild mages, but I can always get another one. Oh, wait, no, are they all in the yard now? I think they are. I can make one, though. I'll just make, I'll just make two on my turn, so I can still do that. So I will go ahead and play the Pelican Worm. I'm down 17 cards, I need to figure something out. I just need a Planner Cleansing. Because the amount of shit I have in my hand is way better than whatever he has in his hand. So never mind. I'm just going to plan or cleanse here. Hopefully I draw it. If I don't draw it, it's whatever. Because, I mean, I'm running out of cards. I don't have time for this garbage anymore. At all. Not at all. I'm going to plan or cleanse. I'm going to lose the seance in the doubling season. But I have Runescar Demon in hand. I have Grizzlebrand in hand. I mean... It's ridiculous right now. I guess I could have killed his 1-1, one, one, but that's just going to let him get one back. Like, I regret everything I've done this entire match. Were you making another one? It's not going to matter here in a second. I mean, if I rune scarred, I still have to wait another turn, I think. Two, four, so it's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's twelve. Okay, so no, I don't. I 
I wonder if he just takes this Vitak for the six in the air. I think I have 13 mana, so I should be okay. Seven. I get the thing. He's deciding what he's going to do. He's only got one card in hand, and I'm going to have Pelica Worm and Grizzle Brand. That's going to be 14 damage out. I'm just going to finally finish this thing, for Christ's sake. I can't wait to watch this back, though. I'm going to be so much better after I watch this back. Holy shit, because I don't think I could have been worse. <laughs> I don't think I could have played worse, so watching it back is going to make me a much better player. What you got going on, man? Little does he know that blocking is definitely the thing to do. I guess he didn't, though, with that with his 6-6. Six, because six. he, I mean, as far as he's concerned, I wonder if he has his own, though, because he's had one card in hand for, like, five years. What's going on here? The meter's not even moving. What's happening? Can I get out of this, though? Yeah, I can. Well, that was anticlimactic. What an anticlimactic end. Can I even... Well, that was exciting. Uh, we're friends on Steam now, though, so that guy and I are going to rematch someday, I hope. Uh, I had a very nice chat with him because chat still works. I mean, it's glad to, I'm glad to know that they put the time and effort into what they need done. He had that spiders thing in hand. He would have got five one two tokens out of the deal. Uh, but at that point, like I said, I would have had grizzle beats and a pelica worm out. My life total would have been ridiculous and getting bigger every turn. So I don't think that the spiders would have been enough to do me in. But of course, you know, you never know what what can happen he had his own doubling season as well that he wasn't able to get to uh you know because he went with the red instead of the black so he doesn't have that tutor really nice guy though i have a very good conversation with him he seems uh, cool you know trying to do something different with his deck and in even a different take on it than mine uh i'm not gonna cut that out because it was really good i mean we both got to talking about misplays that we had made too we talked for damn near 15 minutes or so um nice guy really nice guy uh that's always good to meet people that are that are really nice in the game and everything like that it's like playing against one of you guys um i'm really fucking bummed i mean this game is getting please don't stop watching my channel but i'm getting more and more disappointed with this game constantly uh, fuck. I mean, it's like the third time it's crashed today. Something like that, though. So, you know, I don't even know if my controller thing from yesterday was not this game. Because it's like, I don't know, man. It definitely wasn't Bluetooth because my mouse worked and I don't know. I mean, they obviously added this menu because they realized the menus were unnavigable. So... Like, if you know you fucked up and you just, like, tack in this, like, quick, quick jump and... I don't know, you guys. Shit. It's so much fun, though. Like, the core of this game is better than it has been in years. But it's just, like, fucking dopey how they're doing it. I'm sorry that that match ended that way. It was a really long one. I wish I could have had a, a, a good ending for you. I'm, I'm pretty sure that we would have dug out, but... The amount of misplays I made was insane, so I'm definitely going to watch that back and learn from it. And, you know, hopefully you guys will, will help me out, help me learn a little bit more. Uh, other than the ones that I pointed out already in the video, hopefully you guys can pick up on a couple more things and, and let me know how I could have avoided them. Because uh, I feel like I should have sewn that up earlier on. Uh, of course, he could have beat me, and he did not when he had the chance. Um, we talked about that, though. He and I talked, so... All right, thanks a lot for watching, you guys. I mean, I'm really fucking bummed right now. I mean, that was a fun game as far as I'm concerned. It was a lot more fun than some of the bullshit that happens on here. So I'm, I'm really bummed out. Hopefully that guy will... I, I, I told him, I was like, man, I mean, you can go feel free to, free to friend me and we'll do, you know, a rematch or something because that was fun. And hopefully he'll do that. And 
Oh, no, we can tell him about the channel, so at least he can see where I was coming from during it. Oh, no, fuck it. Uh, thanks a lot for watching, you guys. I really appreciate it. I'll see you all tomorrow.